So, as you can see, we're in an overcrowded Bansko. And even though I'm due like two or three weeks for the video, I've been really busy making cinema quality content of the project we are building right now. Anyway, since I'm up in the mountain after a long time, it's probably a full year since I last skied, I thought it would be nice if I made a video about five photography ideas on the snow. For the first shot, we're gonna have to adjust the GoPro on our ski pole. Either on our ski pole or if you've got a stick, use the stick. Go pole, however you want to call it, use that. But I prefer the ski pole because I don't have to carry something extra with me. You should have something looking like this when you adjust it. And let's switch to the GoPro. And then either it's skiing or snowboarding, you're gonna keep the pole in front of you and you're gonna get a view like this. And that is the way you use a stick or the GoPro pole or whatever to get a shot. Either you got a frame from a video you were shooting or you shoot a long burst. The second photo I'm going to show you is also using the same technique with a pole, but this time I'm going to be on the chairlift. And although it is a classic photo and pretty much anyone who is familiar with a GoPro has taken it, I still love it and I upload at least one every winter. So what you have to do here is get the camera under your skis and cheer. Yeah, I think I got this. This one is pretty simple also. Now for the... God damn it. For photo number three, I would suggest something as a scenery. You can never go wrong and there is always material to shoot. Just have something in the foreground, like a tree and some mountains in the background and you'll get something amazing. So another easy photo you can take is a simple portrait. I would either go into the slopes and have something in the background that I would mess up in the Photoshop or I could use some woods close by. Like this close to the parking lot. 
It looks like you're lost in the woods. The same portrait, you can do it while you're on the slopes. Just remember again to have the model facing towards the sun so you don't get weird black and blues on the face and have something as a deep background so the face should be in the foreground focused and something blurred on the background. And since it's getting late, I'm gonna give you one last proposal about a minimal photo you can take on the mountain pretty much with anything, even with the worst phone you can ever have, even with the worst smartphone you can have, you can get this photo and it can look great. So what you need is you need a chairlift and a really nice background and you're gonna center the chairlift on the thirds somehow, let me show you. And that's a wrap from beautiful Bansko. I'll see you guys next time.